Hello, hello, hello. It's Trisha here from Smooth's Craft Creations. And I'm coming on with a little mini haul. I've already um, shown my wonderful team my little haul. So um, it does help to actually show people um, your actual goodies in your hands. So let's see now. I'm just going to... Um, Move this up a little bit and plug my phone into charge. Let's just make sure this sounds okay. So, there we go. Right, so, all exciting. Um, I want to show you this um, bundle here. The Framed Florets is now live on my online store at smithscraftycreations.stampinup.net. And this is an exclusive um, early release from the next mini catalogue. And it's just gorgeous. Frame flats, absolutely beautiful. Now, the um, paper, the stamp set that is available with it, and also the gems, if I can find them. Oh, what have I done with the gems? I've lost the gems. They are limited um, while supplies last, okay? So, absolutely gorgeous. This one's red rubber. Beautiful, beautiful fonts. We've got these gorgeous frame dies. There's another layer in there as well. I can't wait to start playing with this. I've not had any time. I've had so much business and admin things to do. I've not had much creative time. However, tonight I do have an online uh, private class with my September kit ladies. Um, look at this frame as well. Beautiful. Um, so there is a die for each of the images on this um, stamp set. Yeah, so I've got a craft along a uh, free project tutorial. I've got two projects that I'm going to teach um, the ladies how to make. And um, yeah, those um, kits I do send for free when I do a product suite share. Um, so those kits are free on top of the actual products that I send. This is gorgeous, by the way. Beautiful papers, beautiful colours. Look at all that. I was, I do like autumn, but I do like the, the, the colours of spring and things like that. So it's quite nice to have a, a bright set again. Um, okay, what else did I get? I got a wonderful Very Best Occasions stamp set. Red rubber again. It's gorgeous. So we've got festive um, stamps in here. We have... Um, what else? This one actually coordinates with this punch. No, not that punch. That's the old punch. Where's my new punch? This one. This one here. So this is a bundle and it's absolutely gorgeous. We've got a kind of corner, a fancy corner bit here. We've got a little tag thing and we've got a wee chomper triangle that you can make labels and sentiment layers and things like that. It's really, really, really pretty. Um, so that goes with this, but very best occasions. So it's a versatile red rubber set. So that's uh, another little thing I've got. Uh, this bundle as well, I got from the mini catalogue. It's the handmade wishes and it is the handmade tag punch. Really good size. Let's get a bit of cardstock. Let's chomp it out. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. So that is that one. Beautiful fonts on here. We've got With Love, um, To and From. So it's going to do lots of gift occasions, not just the festivities. Another bundle is the Alphabase bundle. Gorgeous photopolymer set with this adorable little punch. And it punches out these cute little, um, look like little tickets. But obviously they fit around the letters perfectly. Um, and you could also paste these together, stick them together to make a film strip. Or if you're doing kind of vintage ephemera or things like that, you can um, ink it up or use a different colour, obviously, and then add some ink. So there's lots of uses for this little dainty little one. And it is just so sweet. So that's what I got. Another current product punch that I got was the bow punch. Um, you can't go wrong with having a, um, a punch that has um, little leaves and that on it because these are great for quickness for 
example, punching out and maybe sticking in behind your sentiment section um, for floral cards. I'm going to use that with the um, Frame Florets suite. So I'm going to really make use of all my new goodies. Um, this one I got out of clearance, which is the best late... No, it's not the best. Hang on, I've put that in the wrong bit. The best label punch. <laughs> Look, I've put the wrong sticker on it. This is the bow making punch. This is the best label punch. And this is why I stick the little name tags on them, because I always forget the names. <laughs> so this is bow maker. This was in the clearance section. Um, it's a versatile punch. I'll be able to use it year in, year out. And what else did I get? Now, I did get a lot of memento inks and some stamping seals, which were for customer gifts for both um, October into November. Oh, here's the um, the little punch punch outs from this one, from the bow punch. Good size. Love it. Um, so, yeah, got some inks and stuff for um, customer thank yous. And we've got some left over for next month as well. Um... And I always, when I close a workshop order off, I always order my own business supplies like paper, um, if I want a new suite or what have you, I always add that in. And that gives extra rewards on that workshop. Um, and 99.99999% of those rewards always go back to the customers. Um, I did earn a hostess set, which is this um, Begin With A Dream stamp set. Now, um, I managed to get this for £12 which is a reduced value um, because it is a host set. Um, so I am um, going to keep that for myself because I did have to pay for it. But normally during celebration and things when the host sets are free, I do give them out um, a random name picker to customers who shopped in that workshop. Um, I do apologise if my door is going to go. That's the postman just showing up. Um, here we have a gorgeous Christmas gifting kit and this has nine big tags in it. It also has smaller tags that you can put gift cards in, you can put little treats in there. Absolutely adorable. Gorgeous um, stamps as well. Versatile, it's got with love on it just for you too. Um, block, we've got an ink which is shaded spruce. And... What else did I get? Two packs of this because I love it. This was on clearance. This is the cute um, Halloween 6x6 papers. I also got a couple of Hope. Um, is it the Hope one? Where is it? The Hope box paper pumpkin kit. Got a couple of them for customer gifts. <laughs> oh, sorry, my dog's Shh. 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 He's away. It's okay. He's away. Oh, look. <laughs> Hang on, I've got the dogs to do. Come on, he's awake. It's good. Good night. Good night, Come on, Lady Bates. Come on. Good, good house. Good, good house. Sorry about that. Enough. Big dogs have big bark. <laughs> Millie, enough. She'll stop in a minute. She's just saying, uh, she's looking Miss Attitude. Oh, these are the gems that go with the uh, Florette Suite. I knew I'd had them somewhere. Okay, so my last um, goodie is the um, birthday card organiser kit. Now, this is amazing. You get enough for 12 cards. And you get this awesome, 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 awesome card planner. So this is a birthday card organiser kit. We've got pockets in here. We've got the dates of the month. You can add names in, whose birthdays are when. And it's just amazing. It's a really, really, really good size. One of my team said that it uh, recommended the Rose Card Kit would complement this quite nice um, for when you make up all these. Personally, how I will use it, I will make up these cards. However, um, when I've got special friends and crafty friends birthdays coming up, I will make them a specific card and I'll be able to store that in as well. It doesn't need to be these, you can put any cards in that you like. Gorgeous pop-outs. We have got um, the pop-out sentiments in all the different languages. We have 
the days of the, the days of the month, the names of the months. We've got some liner tape. We have some gorgeous little iridescent adhesive back sequins. We have what do you call them? M M dimensionals and glue tops. So that was my offering for October's kit. Um, it was just a really easy one for October. So once all the um, customers receive that, we will just simply do a craft together, spend an hour crafting together and have a laugh and giggles. Um, and it, what the, the whole point of getting together to do the kits um, for free is to make sure that people use their products. You know what it's like, you get something, you put it to the side. Now I've had these since Thursday and I've not played with any of them yet. So that is the whole point. So I'm glad I've got the classes to look forward to. Um, yeah, so hostess code um, for my current workshop is CPRFUCF4. Okay, and um, if you want to shop online, you go to smithscraftcreations.stampinup.net. Later on today, I will be popping up a, a free giveaway that will run for the month. Um, and for example, it might be um, one of these kits, a hope kit. The, you get the stamp set, you get the ink and you get the block in here. Everything you need. These are fully these are fully inclusive kits. I've got one open somewhere but I can't remember where it is. So it would be something like that. What you do is on my business page you would um, simply comment on the post to get an entry. If you tag someone on the post you would get two entries. So if you comment one entry and then you do another post that tags someone that's another two entries but it's only two entries you can only tag someone once if you can't keep tagging and getting two 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 because that would be um a bit unmanageable so um you can comment once you can tag someone once and then if you shop online during um november i can't believe it's november already uh, then you will get an additional five entries so you could get up to eight entries three free ones and five if you shop online during the month of November. So that is my mini haul. Um, I'm just trying to get organised in the background and what have you. Um, oh, I did make one card actually. This was a challenge um, in my uh, Team Smithy, Smithy Stampers team group on Facebook. Um, the team... Um, uh, I get the team to kind of help out with certain tasks, one of which is a monthly, setting a monthly challenge. So um, this was uh, this month's, which was a pop-up card. So the lovely Diane and my team set that challenge. So I need to pick a winner for everybody that entered on that on my team page for someone to receive a gift. And last month we done the Starburst or sunburst technique that Kirsten had set and it was amazing. So um, I think it was Tammy had won um, that gift and the gift was a little branded Stampin' Up! handheld fan that I had got whilst in New Orleans at the backstage. So I sent that to um, Tammy as a little gift and it's just a little memento all the way from Stampin' Up! event in um, New Orleans. So that is all I've made recently, if I'm honest. Um, what else have I been up to? I've been getting over this virus. I'm happy to report that it's gradually, gradually, gradually disappearing, guys. Um, it's been a long three weeks, coming and going and coming and going. Still coughing a lot at night and things like that, but um, not as bad. And as long as I'm able to function the next day uh, relatively easy enough, then uh, I'm happy. I could be up all night coughing, but if I feel okay the next day, I'm very happy. So... Anyway, love yous and leave yous. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. Um, there is one, at least one video goes up every week following on from my Saturday Live on Facebook. I put the replay up um, and then some extras in between. I'm hoping to get more and more uh, videos up on the channel soon. Um, like I say, I just don't know where time's going just now. Um, for someone that works at home and has no travel time or anything like that, I just can't can't seem to get the extra hours in the day. So, anyway, enough of that boring stuff. 
I hope you're all well. I hope you're all crafting. Um, you will find links to Crafty's Tramping Club on Facebook in the description box and my blog and my store, uh, my Instagram account, things like that. Have a little nosy. Come and give me a little follow. Um, if any projects have inspired you at all, tag me on Facebook. Add me personally as a friend. I don't mind. Um, I'm on social media quite a lot because I don't go out an, an awful lot, as you know. With my ME, I am in the house more than I am not in the house. Um, so, yeah, the more company, the better on Facebook, I see. We're here to inspire, we're here to create, and we're here to make new friendships. So, adios amigos. I will see you again soon, and uh, enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.